Zinnia, are you eating already? You coming in, John? Well, good morning. So here we are on the farm on uh, Coronavirus Monday. And one thing we were thinking about is the farm, it's great, is that it goes on, it has a life of its own. You gotta eat, and it gives a structure to kind of the day. As we're all getting up and wondering about our new reality. What's gonna happen here? Yeah, what happened? So the pasture is the way it is, and the donkeys are just want their snacks. I know, they, the so animals- she just, she just butted- uh, She just butted Liam. Butted the animals Liam. don't The animals don't know the difference. Um, and so it, it kind of it's kind of grounding to, to come into something that's so completely normal when you come into the barnyard. Right, the lab is trying to eat donkey food, but the state is usual doing nothing meaningful. <laughs> Right. And so the donkeys are getting impatient. You want me to get the hay? That would be great. All right. I'll because get you know we got to feed the animals. It's Every like, day, no matter what. That's right. Everything, everything in the barnyard is uh, it's like a place of, of normal. Head fake. Get the sheep. Get the sheep. There she goes. <laughs> Sometimes I think that um, Zinnia thinks she's one of the sheep. She kind of looks like them, but they don't. Uh, they don't think so. They're always chasing her away and butting her away. As much as she tries to be friendly with them. Hey, get the sheep. Go on, get the sheep. Hey, Biddy. And the birds are singing. It's the geese are starting to come back. Soon our, um, our goose couple will be here. John's here with the hay. Get the sheep, Faye. So I'm like the Bedlam Farm person at risk. I'm like the old man at risk. It's true. It means that I have to do everything Maria tells me to do. <laughs> so that's what that's I'm doing. Right. That's, that's my right. <laughs> I'm kind of, I don't know. There's some good things about this, John. I know. You, get, you have to listen to me. I get up every morning and say, what does Maria and Tony, <laughs> Dr. Tony Fauci want me to do today? That's what I'm going to do. I think being outside is a really good thing to do. She We've... laid down the law to me the other day and told me what it was I was going to do and what it was I was not going to do. <laughs> and I said, okay, this is one argument. I guess I'm just not going to win. <laughs> right? True? That's true. All That's right. true. So, so the message to all of you men at risk out there and women at risk out there, do what your spouses tell you to do. It's like that guy who, when we got married, the guy gave me this advice. You just say to your wife all the time, you're probably right here. You know, I think that works. It works. I, I, I'm good with that. And that's how you know I'm going to get through it, too. 